Hey everyone, it's Jamie. Today's video is a Dollar Tree haul, and um, it's not a real big one, but I did find some new things that I've never seen at Dollar Tree before. So I'm excited to show you guys what I found. So the first thing that I found is this uh, gift boxes. You get three in here, and these are so cute. Um, and Dollar Tree is doing something different this year too, where they're putting, now this is not on all of them, but I found some of the, the gift boxes have pictures of what gift boxes are in there. So if I can get that close enough for y'all to see, those are the three that are in this um, pack right here. But uh, you get three and I just thought these were so pretty with the red and black buffalo check and it's got a reindeer on there. And then you got this wintery scene with the Christmas trees and then um, this one right here, it says, uh, the happiest season of all. So this is the front side, and then it shows you the one that's on the back. So um, I went ahead and picked up these. I thought those were really cute. The next set of gift boxes that I found, these just remind me of like a vintage Christmas. You know, old time Santa Claus. Um, but you get three in here, and they do show the pictures of the boxes that you get. So I think these are really cute. Um, like this one that's on the front, it's got Santa by a, a train, which I think is really, really cute. And then um, on the back side here, it's got him just riding on his sleigh, waving to all the good little boys and girls. So I think this is so cute. And... Um, some of these I'm going to be not using as gift boxes, but I'm going to be framing them. So, um, and I just wanted something that looked kind of an old time vintage Christmas. So I grabbed those and then, um, I found these, these are a little bit bigger. Um, you get three in here and these also have the pictures of what boxes are in there, what they look like. So this is another one that's sort of a old time vintagey looking uh, Santa Claus. And these ones are the ones I think I'm going to frame. Um, but if you can see the pictures there, it shows you uh, what, what they look like. And um, here's the back. I think that's really cute. <laughs> um, and then I found these. And these, uh, these are awesome. You get three in here, and these are also a little bit bigger. But, um, and they do show you what you're getting, pictures of the boxes that you're getting. But just look at this farm truck on the front here. This is like a real photo, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? Not like the cartoony uh, kind, but this is an actual pickup truck that they took a picture of with the Christmas tree in the back. And I think that is so cool. So um, I may end up framing this one also, but then again, I may just use it um, as gift, gift wrap. So, um, and then this back one is of Santa's belly. <laughs> so I think that's really cute. So um, I really liked that one. And then I was able to find this one and it's the bigger gift box, but it's the, the big giant one. Um, but I really like this because it's got like a vintagey sort of candy cane on there. Um, I don't know. I just really liked it. Uh, I did open this part up so I could see what it says, but it says traditional candy cane, home with or homemade with care, uh, Claus candy shop. <laughs> so I think that is really, really cute. So I was able to find this, but I think they have another one that's sort of a vintage -y style that I'm going to be keeping my eyes out for. Um, something else that I found, these are so cute. They are gift tags. You get 25 in here, but these are really neat. They, I don't know, they give me like a Grinch kind of feel with that green color. But I thought these were really cute. I liked the sayings on there. Like this one says, best gift ever. And then uh, this one down here um, says, has the little boxes. Check naughty, check for nice. 
uh, or don't ask. <laughs> but I thought that was really cute too. You can see that with the, I'm sorry about the glare. And then this other one says, no peeking, sniffing, shaking, I'll find out. <laughs> so I thought that was really cute too. I couldn't pass these up. I had to get those. I thought those, I mean, they're funny, right? So I grabbed those. Um, the next thing that I picked up was this let it snow sign and I know they have the ones with the Santa I think it's Santa Claus and his hat says ho ho ho, but I really liked the snowman one So I did go ahead and grab it But I think this is really cute. So um, I did just grab one though The next thing that I picked up is one of these uh, red and black buffalo plaid um, like Santa hats and it's got the faux fur around it and then the faux fur little tassel ball or whatever at the top. So I did pick that one up. I also went ahead and grabbed two of these ornaments. You get seven in here. And um, like I said before, I'm doing my Christmas theme is red and black uh, buffalo check. And um, so for my Christmas tree, which I still need to get me a Christmas tree, I gave my uh, old one to my daughter because she didn't have a tree. So this year I need to buy me a new one. So if anyone knows of any good places to buy Christmas trees, I want one that's um, flocked. So I don't know. I hate to order one online because I'm afraid I won't get it in time for Christmas the way shipping is. Shipping seems like it's awful slow lately. But anyway, um, so I went ahead and grabbed two packages of these and these have the red balls in them. They come with um, the plat or the uh, sort of like a matte or a satin red ball and then one that's glittery and they just give you an assortment of those. So I did grab two of those and then um, I wanted to get some of the giant ornaments that they had, um, but they were about out of them. So I was able to find three of these red ones. So I went ahead and grabbed three of them. And these are, you know, a little bit larger size. Um, I think I'm gonna try and see if I can't find some that are even bigger than this to put on my tree. So, but I did, find three of those. Hopefully I can find some more. I'd like to find some that are um, like black and red buffalo checked, but I don't know if there's anywhere that has those or not. So um, let's see. Oh, this, this was new. I've never seen this at Dollar Tree before either. It's LED makeup mirror by Sassy and Chic. Um, it's an LED light, great for your purse or your travel bag, requires two AAA batteries that are not included. But I thought this was really neat. Now they have this in a couple of different colors. I liked the white one, but it's showing that it lights up. And I thought, wow, that is really cool. So I did grab one of these because I think I'm going to be putting this in uh, my beauty giveaway. So I did grab one of those. Um, the next thing that I picked up is, this is boring, but it's um, by Toolbench, and it's just felt pads. You get uh, 27 pieces in here, and there's all different sizes. I got this because um, my mom gave me a antique iron bed, and I have wood floors, and I didn't want my floors getting scuffed up or scratched, so um, I'm going to put this underneath the, the legs of the bed, the feet of the bed, so that it doesn't scratch my floor. So there's that. Um, let's see. I found this, and I've never seen this at the Dollar Tree either, but it's an LED hanging lamp, and they had, this one is in silver. Now, they had one, I believe it was a gold color, but I really liked the silver one, and I've never seen this before, but I'm looking at uh, this picture right here, and that is really cool. So, um... I'm not sure if it's going to work or how well it's going to work, but I'm going to take it out of the box here and show you guys. It looks like one of those Edison kind of light bulbs you can see in there, but um, it just hangs. And then the top 
has the little tab that you pull out and then you can turn it on. Um, so anyway, I thought that was really cool. I've never seen it before. I'm going to go ahead. Oh, look. All I did was pull the tab up a little bit. That is really neat. It is bright. <laughs> but um, I only got one of these because I wasn't sure how well it was going to be, if it, how well it was going to work or anything like that. And I didn't want to get a bunch and then it not, you know, they'd be duds. But wow, that is really cool. So I don't know where I would put it, but <laughs> it's really cool. So um, I don't know. Maybe I'll get some more if I happen to see any. And then I have one more thing around here, if I can find it. it seems like I, I have everything strung out here on my couch. So, give me a second. <laughs> oh, okay. Here it is. I had it sitting behind me. I've never seen this either. This is new. Um, Crafter Square, and it's a roller cutter. I've never seen this at the Dollar Tree before, so... I went ahead and grabbed it. I'm not sure how well it's going to cut, but I figured for a dollar, if it cuts really good, then hey, I got a good deal. But it says that it's great for cutting paper, fabric, vinyl, and more. So, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if it works. But anyway, I believe that is everything. Let me see. Yep. That is everything, guys. That's my haul for the day. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, would you please give it a thumbs up? If you haven't subscribed, um, go ahead and subscribe. I would appreciate it. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful day. I'll talk to you all later. Bye.